Hey guys, my name's Bloomch, and today I'm going to be teaching you how to fix your Hamachi server. So I get comments daily on saying my Hamachi server will not work. So, first thing you're going to have to do is restart your PC. If you've just installed Hamachi, make sure you restart your PC. That's probably why it's not working, so you have a direct tunnel problem. Uh, somebody asked me, how do I change my server so it works off my Hamachi's IP instead of my actual IP? First step is you open Hamachi and you're done. That That's it. Yeah. That's how you get your server hosted on this IP. All you have to do is give your friend this IP before the slash and then you will be able to join. You can't join mine because you don't know the password. So, second thing is you need to type in firewall in your start bar. Go to Windows Firewall. Allow a program or feature through firewall. And then click uh, L and then scroll down until you see Log Me and Hamachi. Both of you need to do this. Both. Everyone who's connecting to the servers need to do this. I'm not sure if you have to do Cube World as well, but I would just in case. And what you also need to do for the person that's hosting the server is open the server software, then close it. So if you don't know what the server software is, we'll go here, and then you go to Program Files, and then oh, press C, then go to Cube World, and see this server.exe. What you want to do is open it, then close it. Then you'll want to click Allow Another Program, I think. And then press S and you'll see server.exe. This is for Autodesk. This is for something else. But if I click here, there's my server. And it should either be in there or you should allow another program. You need to click home and public as well. This is necessary. You need to do this. And that's basically it. Make sure you both have done all the firewall stuff. Make sure the person who's hosting the server allows the server.exe through public. And make sure you restart your PC if you're having direct tunnel problems. That's the only advice I have. If that doesn't work, then you are doing something wrong. This definitely works. I've heard loads of people come back to me saying thank you. You can read the comments if you like in my other video. And then, that's it. This is the advice I'd give to everyone whose server doesn't work. And it's worked for them. I've helped countless people with their servers. And they've all thanked me. So, hope you enjoyed. Hope I helped. If I did, make sure you leave a thumbs up. If you're not already subscribed, make sure you consider subscribing. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks. Bye.